Um, I, look, I, all I do is get in trouble for saying it's all connected, but folks, it is all connected. We know now that the um, Cloak and Dagger characters are gonna be crossing over and everyone's really excited about that. How did that happen? And then was there any thinking about sort of very subtly connecting the Hulu series through the Marvel Netflix series because of the Freeform series? Well, it, just to be clear, there is there is no Netflix in any of that, so, it, but in the... Well, there was a Netflix character, I believe, one of Missy's cop friends in the Freeform Oh, that show, part. So that's kind of... Yeah, okay, I'm got it. Wow, you're really playing... <laughs> you're shows, you're yeah. playing... You're, yeah, there you go. Um, I, look, I, all I do is get in trouble for saying it's all connected, but folks, it is all connected. And look, this was an opportunity that we talked about really in season one. The young heroes of the Marvel Universe have always had a relationship with each other. Yeah, Cloak and Dagger in the Runaways book, so it's always been something that we wanted to do. And this year, it just really made sense in terms of the story that we were telling and how our story connects to something that is happening also in their world. Yeah, and it was also something the cast all knows each other from the different shows, and they, it was something they were excited about doing. And I think we've all been very proactively knocking on Jeff's door and saying, can we do it this year, Jeff, please? And so this was the year that we that it all came together, and it's going to be great. To be honest, this season was a very challenging season for all of us. I think having Olivia and Aubrey come into our world really helped us. They brought such great energy to set and it united everybody and then carried on with their energy even when they had left and used what we had you know, taken from the episode and really tried to finish the season strongly. So we, we loved having them on set. Yeah, it was pretty awesome. Also, you know, Cloak and Dagger, just to get to see their power sort of mix with ours, uh, the dynamics of us, you know, as we, we banter a lot on the show and sort of crack jokes back at each other, sometimes meanly, but it's like uh, <laughs> sort of getting to see them uh, jump into that fold. That was super fun. Getting to see, you know, power sort of mesh together. That was so, I can't wait to watch it because we're doing this all day. We're not. <laughs> She's doing this all day. They're doing these things all day without anything there. Mm -hmm. When we actually get to see it, I'm excited for that. Yeah, in addition, I think at the point that Cloak and Dagger are now, they have no idea that other kids have powers like they do. And it's really exciting to play with that dynamic. And I think when they come together, it's almost like uh, you're expanding onto a whole new world of what Marvel can do in the TV world. And just to see that on screen for the first time with our show works extremely lucky and extremely best.